A legend on the hardwood at Dundalk High School was honored tonight. Tracy Carrington, the all-time leading scorer for the school. A few months ago, she was killed outside of a bar in Overly. WMAR 2 News' Eddie Kadem was there as they retired her jersey tonight. 13 will never be worn again. The shot clock Tracy Carrington had beat to score over 1,000 points stuck on it. Her twin brother taking his time, his best friend since birth, taken in an instant. She was a person that really wanted to see people succeed, you know? I mean, growing up, we grew in a part of Baltimore where not too many people make it out, you know? When she got to Morgan State, the school's all-time scoring leader, Tiny Adams, quickly heard about the fiery young guard from Baltimore. So the first time I met her, she challenged me to a game. So just her heart or rip, her passion for the game, and I just kind of gravitated towards each other. So that's how I kind of started the relationship. She went on to play overseas, just starting to get into coaching when she was shot several times outside of a bar. She led by example. You know, she didn't just go in there and impose her will. She just stepped on the court and said, hey, we're going to do it this way, and we're going to all roll together. You know, she had that tenacity, and she didn't back down from anything. Her high school coach calls her the daughter she never had and an older sister to her son. She was about to start training him the weekend she was killed. Tracy was going to give back. Tracy was going to give to the young kids and, you know, this generation, the, the guidance, you know, the mentorship, the, you know, and the coaching and the teaching, you know, and just, you know, being a positive role model. The ones who loved her, carrying her legacy, her spirit living on through the number she wore and the people she touched. Do everything 100 percent, and that's what Tracy did, 100 percent. If you want to be a football player, basketball player, want to be a scientist, want to go to college, really do that. In Dundalk, Eddie Kadem. <laughs> WMAR 2 News.